This is where it all started at, right here. Yes, we can. Yes, we can. Do you like bro broken homes? Yes, we can. Do you like broken communities? Yes, we can. Do you like uh, broken families? Yes, we can. Everything in Chicago is controlled by the Democratic Party. Everything in my community is controlled by black Democrats. There is no Tea Party in my community. There is no Republicans in my community. So they can't blame Republicans. They can't blame Tea Parties. Most American people, especially people of my advocacy, they don't understand that people create jobs, not government. They think I, if I go out to get a job, prime example, they have a, a thousand jobs at Walgreens offering, you got a half a million people standing in line. They don't understand a lot of Americans, including people of my ethnicity, they don't understand that people, since the pop and the mom shops, create jobs. Democrats have been in control of, of this community for about 40 years. Right. And my question to you is, do you feel that it's the, the policies of the party have, have helped this community or no. hurt this community? It has hurt this community because they feel like that they can just take us for granted and that we're just going to vote Democratic anyway. But if there was a Republican who was out here doing what I feel he should be doing, I would vote for him. There have been a lot of moving with players at the table within a community that have been there for a while, but there's no effect again. Do you think that their interest is in the community or are they self-motivated? I think they're self-motivated and in a lot of cases their interest is not in the community and in a lot of cases a lot of them don't even live in the community. And is that black leadership or white leadership? Or? It's it's um, it's black leadership. It's black leadership. What kind of support do you think that you're getting from the president, being a you know being a former, being from Chicago? Well, right now I haven't seen that much support from the president as far as these communities are concerned. What I've seen is he's put his support overseas. Well, those the same support he's putting overseas, he should put here in this neighborhood because we are hurting too. We're not happy with what's going on. And the only way we get to the bottom of this is that we take a step back and we say that we're undecided at this point. We're undecided because our agenda has not uh, 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 been met on, has not been adhered to. And it's almost as if it's just saying, just oh, even though you got nothing, even though nobody has, has uh, addressed your issues, just go with them anyway. And we say no. President's policies failing the black community or helping? It's failing. It's failing. It's failing. Are you, are you planning on supporting the president in the upcoming election? Um, no, I'm not. I'm not. No. I mean, I'll pray about it. And in whatever way God leads me to that person that's going to help, that's the person that I will vote for. What do you think the biggest obstacle is to jobs going to residents of the community? We're not included. Who's doing the hiring? Who's controlling where the money goes? As far as the community outreach, once again, these community-based organizations that's taking money and shuffling paperwork, but not really reaching out to the community. And then the first thing that holly is, oh, they have no training. But then after you train them, the first thing that holly is, oh, you're not in the union. Well, the union won't let us in as a whole. They will not let us in. They figure out any ways to close the door stuff. I'm not union. Even though I'm a union carpenter, that's what I, the union trained me, but the union doesn't work for me because I, I'm going to say it right out. They're prejudiced against us. Does the black community want jobs? The black community need jobs. We need them, we want them, and it's a matter of life and death to us. It is more important, it is more important in this community that they promote the liberal agenda than the black agenda. What about the black family? What about the American family? I tell you that the liberal agenda is not the black agenda. It is not the family agenda, and it's not the American agenda.